We're going to open up some bad news, which hopefully is not as bad as it sounds on the surface. I'm sure many of you are aware that Lana's mom and dad both ended up with coronavirus, and her mom has asthma. And so on top of everything else, her mom was in the ICU. And I think it was today, actually. Roots have also has a show here on Twitch. And in fact, I believe Wednesdays, when the wrestling block kicks off again, Rusev will be following our show uh, here on Twitch. And he announced on his program that, in fact, he has tested positive for coronavirus. Now, I didn't see it, but I mean, I saw like screenshots. He appears to be uh, asymptomatic. I could be wrong, but he explained that he'd gotten a test. And the test was negative. And then he took another test. And this time the test was positive. And, of course, that happens. It happens a lot. And that's one of the reasons why when we talk about, you know, especially AEW now. WWE, they have their alleged mask mandate. They're allegedly fining people if they don't wear their masks. And, of course, they did this after, like, 30-plus people ended up infected between wrestlers and agents and everything else. But... There has never been a coronavirus case thus far in AEW. The closest that we've come was uh, John Moxley's wife, Renee, who got it from WWE, went home, and Moxley stayed in the house, spent like two weeks with her while she was sick, and he managed to never get it. Nobody in AEW has gotten it yet. Now, they do testing they they do legitimate uh, coronavirus testing, which WWE also is doing now. They also check your temperature. But despite all of that, as as Rusev has noted here, things can happen. I mean, it appears that he had coronavirus, and the first test came up negative. And then a few days later, he took it again, and this time it came up positive, and he has coronavirus. So a uh, point of all of this, number one, is that AEW should be having everybody in the crowd wear those masks. I mean, everybody's wearing masks now. There were masks last night at New Japan. There were masks at UFC. Everybody's wearing their masks. Everybody should be wearing their masks now. Now, the good news is Lana's mom has been moved out of the ICU, and it's looking like in the next day or two she may be allowed to go home. So Lana was very concerned. It was obviously bad. Uh, Mom in ICU, but now mom is out. Uh, her father had it for apparently about two weeks, and I guess sounds like he had a somewhat mild case. Uh, he thought he had seasonal allergies, nose was running, finds out he has coronavirus. And I guess it wasn't that mild because he was in bed for two weeks and felt terrible, but he appears to be on the mend as well. And so far, doesn't look like Lana has it, or at least she has not come out publicly, and Rusev now has it, so I guess he'll be dealing with that. And uh, hopefully everybody ends up 100%, but you cannot mess around with the coronavirus as more and more people in wrestling, and obviously around the comp- uh, the country, are starting to find out. Any thoughts on any of this, Mike? Well, no, just uh, another uh, homespun tale for everybody to be careful. A friend of my brother's who lives in uh, Baltimore uh, went out, and he's a young guy, in shape, everything, and went out and... I uh, was feeling rough, thought he had a sinus infection, and just thought that's what it was. No problem with his lungs or anything like that. Just thought it was an allergies and then thought it was a sinus infection. And then ultimately it ends up being COVID. And then obviously the story of Lana's whole family right now and now with Rusev getting it. It's just, you know, Florida had a massive, what was it, like 12,000 people or something. It was a ridiculous amount of people that they tested that came up positive. So this is not going anywhere. 15,000 from- today. That's it's staggering. That's absolutely staggering. And regardless of what you think about it, this is a very real thing. How you choose to go about it, I guess, is how you choose to go about it. But wear your mask, wash your hands, take care of yourself, take care of others, and be careful. I'm pretty sure this stat is correct, but and someone can, can let me know if I'm wrong, but I believe that Florida today logged more cases in a single day than China did when the outbreak began over an extended period of time. In one day in Florida. Certainly more than the entire country of South Korea has actually reported in this time as well, too. So 